cut her go TA. More like cut her go away. <laughs> Am I right? Who's with me? Okay. For the uninitiated, Cutter Gauthier is a hockey player who was drafted to the Philadelphia Flyers in the 2023 NHL Draft. And then, before he even played a game, he was acquired from the Philadelphia Flyers by the Anaheim Ducks. Danny said that Cutter didn't want to play here in Philadelphia and didn't want to play for the Flyers. What's your reaction to that? Then we don't want you. Cutter played for the D1 hockey team at Boston University. And just this year, they made it to the NCAA Hockey Championship and face off against the University of Denver for the title. Boston University was the number one seed and the University of Denver was the number three seed, so the match was not thought to be very uneven. However, Boston University seemed to be the favorite to win by many. Before the game, they interviewed Cutter Gauthier about it and what it meant to him to be in the championship, and this is what he said. There's going to be a lot of emotions, um, you know, and a lot of tears for that team over there, so uh, we're happy and we're excited to get after it. Now, listen, I'm all for personality in hockey, but this kind of thing is just stupid. And it's even worse if you end up not being able to back it up and losing the game, which they did. There's a certain level of respect that you, that you should give your opponent in any sort of professional sport. And I know what people are going to say. Hey, you don't play sports. Where do you come in? Listen, people do things like run up to score and fight, but that is something that is within the game and it's part of playing. And I know that just because I played at the lesser levels of hockey. It's about respect. Honestly, even trash talking opponents on ice is done fairly frequently in pretty much every league going down to like double A bantam hockey. So even that's not that bad. But all of the things that I listed are things that are between you and your opponent. This is not the WWE. You're not cutting a promo to get people to buy into a feud between you and the opposing team. You should treat the game and your opponents with respect and getting interviewed and saying that the guys you're playing don't have a shot at winning and that they're going to be crying after the game is just annoying and it kind of sucks on top of being disrespectful. And also, I, I hate to bring it up again, but they lost. Another thing, I don't think Cutter realizes that with the things he's doing and the name he's making for himself, he's perfect for Philadelphia. I've met guys from Philly and they're not all like this, but I've been there myself. Cutter, you'd fit right in. Anyway, long story short, BU lost. Denver had a miracle run. Cutter signed a three-year deal with the Anaheim Ducks, but I gotta say, that whole thing was just annoying and embarrassing for him. But, you know, he's young, so whatever. Anyways, that's all I got for you today. Hope you enjoyed the video and remember to like, subscribe. Peace.